New this morning, former military and government officials with knowledge of or experience with unidentified flying objects are sharing their run-ins with News Nation. This comes after an uptick in reports of UFOs in recent weeks, and Xavier Walton has that story. Dude, what is that? For centuries on Earth, millions have wondered what else is out there. When I first saw it, I thought, I'm... I'm seeing the formation of a tornado. Trish Bishop, who was an intelligence analyst in the Army, is convinced that tornado was really her first UFO encounter back in 2018, and it wouldn't be her last. It's something that I think about every day. How many encounters would you say you've had? I would say six, six encounters. Trish was on season one of UFO Witness on Discovery Plus. I want to go check it out for myself. Ben Hansen, a former FBI agent turned paranormal investigator, hosts the show. The question now is when is the rest of the world going to, to find it? When are we going to find out what these things are? If we're not careful and we don't stay ahead of this and help people uh, assimilate to what might be coming, we could have big, big problems society-wise. A UFO report released last summer, mandated by Congress, revealed 65% of the survey's respondents think there is intelligent alien life on planets other than Earth, while 87% said UFOs aren't a security threat to the United States. I'm calling it an anomaly because we just don't know what it is. Mark Halsey, a former F-18 fighter pilot, says he saw as many as seven mysterious objects recently on a flight from Florida to Hawaii. It's pretty, uh, pretty weird stuff. Being at 47,000 feet, you would never expect to look up and see aircraft. What are you thinking this was? I wish I could tell you. I mean, that's the million dollar question, right? I can tell you what it was not. It wasn't any conventional aircraft that I'm aware of. It wasn't any military aircraft. If a military is going to be conducting um, top secret aircraft uh, missions, they're not going to be flying around with lights on. In Miami, Xavier Walton, News Nation. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.